In this video, I'm going to show you how to send and receive an encrypted message on cyber definitions. Start by entering your secret crypto word. So I'm going to use elephant. Of course, it doesn't have to be something as simple as elephant. It can be anything, including a string of random letters. Anyway, let's put elephant back in. And now let's type our message that's to be encrypted. Meet me at McDonald's at Ten hundred hours. And then you press encrypt. And here you have your encrypted message, which you can copy and send, or you can use these buttons to share it over WhatsApp or email or whatever. What I'm going to show you now is how the message is encrypted and you will see that it is very secure. So here is our encrypted message, which has been sent over WhatsApp. This message includes the link where it can be decrypted, but you do not have to include that link in the message. So remember, this was our secret message. Step one, every character in that message is converted into its ASCII two number. Now, its ASCII 2 number is just the number that tells the computer what character it is. So these are the ASCII 2 numbers for all of the characters in that message. So 77 is a capital M, etc. Step 2. The ASCII 2 numbers are all converted to hexadecimal. That's base 16. And the spaces are removed. So that gives us this. This is already illegible, but there are more steps. In step three, every number, not letter, in that message from step two is converted to a letter between P and Y. So zero would be converted to P and nine would be converted to Y and everything in between. So that would give us this. So this D was originally from the hexadecimal, but this P is actually a zero from the hexadecimal, and this Q is actually a one from the hexadecimal. So we've now got a pretty illegible string, but there's more. Remember your secret word. Well, a table is created with the number of columns that are in your secret word. So if you remember, our secret word was elephant. So this is our table. These columns are now numbered according to the alphabetical order of your secret word. So the A is first, the first E is second, the second E is third, the H is fourth, the L is fifth, the N is 6th, the P is 7th, and the T is 8th. The message from step 3 is then entered into the table. And it's entered from left to right, like this. In step 5, the columns are read downwards in the order determined by your crypto word. So we start with column 1 and read it down, column two, read it down, column three, column four, column five, column six, column seven, and column eight. And that gives us this, and it's converted to uppercase. But that's not quite the end. After every fifth character, a random letter is put in for padding. And this is to make it even more difficult to decrypt. So this message is decrypted by doing the reverse of the encryption process. So as you can see, it's very secure. And that is how your message, Meet Me at McDonald's at 10 hundred hours, became this seemingly random string of uppercase letters. Remember, 
It is possible just to share the letters. You don't have to share that link, but if you want to share the link, then there's a button for that too. Thanks for watching. Safe messaging.